Welcome to an introduction to accounting and to Quasar Accounts, which I'm now just going to open up, which is an accounting system for Linux. And in this particular case, we're going to look at setting up some of the account types. So if I go to set up, account types obviously refer to the ledger. So I'm going to go across from ledger to account types and just open that. And you can see here that what I've got is I've already set up some account types. Unlike many uh, accounting programs, many pieces of accounting software where you are presented with a default system of accounts, that doesn't happen in Quasar unless you want to copy details from one company to another. Uh, what you do is you set up your own sequence of accounts, which I've started here. You can see that I've set up my asset accounts and I've called my asset accounts, I've divided them into types or groups if you like, fixed assets, inventory accounts receivable, current assets, and I've also set up my liability accounts, accounts payable, other current liabilities, long-term liabilities, and so on. So my next accounts would actually be, if you look at the series, I've gone from 0010 up to 2599, and I could actually alter that as well and edit that. But what I'm going to do is just say for the moment I'm going to do a new series and I'm just going to pull that down there and I'm going to say that the next type that I want is going to be an equity account and I'm just going to call it for the moment equity I'm not going to give it a parent type, but I'm going to say that this one goes from the series of 3000 to 3500. So I would just make that easier and say it goes to 3499. That leaves us with the possibility of putting in another account type, which are also equity accounts. So I save that. And I can now see that I've got an equity account there. I just want to do one more of these and we're going to sort of jump ahead a bit really and say that I want to put in sales income and the category of course will be that it is an income statement account and I'm going to start it off with a sequence at 4000 to 4499 so that gives me room to put in more in the sales income or in the income uh, accounts numbers there so I'm going to save that and we're going to add that that's fine and that's how we set up slowly building up our account types later on we'll show you how we put accounts in within those account types but, but just for the moment that's our account types.